entourage of other players sitting to my right, helping us right now. Four players sitting to my right. We got the heaters right here. Oh, so they're not even here for us. They're here because they're cold and they're weak. The so right there. <laughs> you are in the optimal seat. We don't feel nothing. We don't feel anything. We are We're under it. Right here. All, all, the, all the heat we feel. Exactly, so it's optimal for you. All the heat we feel is so we generated got, by us being hyped. We got a bayonet by someone. Tsunami is trainer. Okay, so we got it right the first time. We're killing it oh, already. Oh, Big we're, we're, Big we're, we're on, we're on right. key right now. So we got Pokemon trainer and Bayonetta. We got this another is, Bayonetta. What is this? See, see, see. Whoa! She's flying oh, away. Hey, yo, she has a lot of practice with <laughs> flight. She got wings in a kit. But I mean, hey, one thing I want to see out of this fight is I want to see Pokemon Trainer get caught in Witch Time uh -huh. and then dodge the attack by swapping out. Because it already has a good bit of invincibility. But then bring tactics right there. But honestly, I have to say that I give this, this I dare this give this a bayonetta. I dare the, give this the bayonetta. Bay the bayonetta clearly not as just insane as Baron. Baron just killing it with the character. A lot more controlled, a lot more calculating, a lot more, a lot less risk taking. This you know? is this is a lot more of the like slow and low cook versus we have Baron. He just wants the water boiling. Hey, yo, I'm just, he wants I'm, the food done. Hey, yo, this man woke up hungry and has no time to wait for breakfast. That's what the last bail was like. Exactly. This bail likes to use crock pots and slow cookers. Exactly. That's what we're, that's what we're working with here. It's a nice see. grab by Squirtle, uh -huh. keeping the pressure on. On his, on his, so far, on his, Squirtle's staying in for a lot longer than normal. Usually you're dropping out at about 60%. Squirtle's staying in knowing that Bayo struggles to combo lighter and smaller characters. And that's that's character knowledge in itself. But, but hey, if you get punched in the face, you got to you, fly you, away. You, I, I don't care if you got a hard shell on your back. Madama Butterfly don't care. She wants some Bob. turtle shells for breakfast. I keep talking about food and I'm hungry now. Anyway, ooh, that could have been a devastating situation. Yeah. I know, I know, right. it's really hard to spike Bayonetta out of your witch twist like that because yeah. the hitbox covers are going up. But, but the, but the, the hitbox on that on uh, on Ivy Swords up in the, uh, a down air. Ooh, with the vines. It's very big. Very right, so big. We got the Charizard now. <laughs> this might actually be a, as you just said, yeah, struggles, struggles, struggles combooing lighter characters. The eye is gonna work a lot better in, in this in this situation since he's not as heavy and influence is gonna do a lot more. Keeping the percents very even here between the two. Players. No pun is very, on that very slide, cozy. Though. Robbie's prophecy. The, the, the squirrel tail on Squirtle doing a lot of work whipping that girl into shape. She's flying around, making it, staying in the air, making it really hard for any real combo openers to start off the Squirtle because a lot of his combos start off that, off of either dash attack or grab. So if you stay in the air, you can, you know, stay free of both of those. And as we can see right now, even with that situation, Jennings is only keeping himself away from damage, but isn't doing much. And it even seems that now Tsunami is starting to catch on and starting to position himself in such ways that if, if a whip happens, he can easily accommodate and get some and, kind of damage. And that's why the percentage difference is so big right now, is Tsunami is literally just looking for any opportunity he can take advantage of. Getting him off stage with his neutral beam, pushing him away, letting him just try and burn his jumps and all that and not be able to recover. Honestly, just hang himself. With uh, Squirtle's side B with the... Uh, I, I want to call it... Whenever I don't know names of moves... Rapid Spin. Uh, it's Rapid Spin. I was going to call it Shell Shock. I make oh, I make up my own name, names for moves, but like I'm just it's, guessing it's Rabbitson because I'm a Pokemon player. I know, oh really? I know, I know my stuff. Oh really? All right, I've, I've been I've been graced with knowledge once again. Thank you very much. Absolutely, absolutely. Mr. Pegasus, you are a beautiful human being, and I hope as you know that. Thank you, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. But see, in this situation, I I wouldn't really agree with keeping Ivy Sword in. I, I feel like I feel like Ivy Sword doesn't have is like a hybrid of both Charizard and Squirtle in this game, and doesn't do enough. So enough now, of either my, to really my get counter argument done. like mm -hmm. just trying to take his logic for a second yes. you have to also remember Charizard is very easy to combo with oh, yes. as the big and heavy character yes so Squirtle that. is good for racking up that early damage mm -hmm. Ivysaur is great for getting those kills I was so. just about to say yeah. that that's the Not one the thing that Ivysaur does well that Squirtle and Charizard have a little bit more because with Squirtle it's just combos Charizard you have that up B was big brain to stop the F smash. That would have been a terrible situation. Imagine getting caught with a water gun there. Easy down smash for the kill. That was 
That was a terrible so, angle to be sent. Jacket. So big thing with tsunami here too. I'm already noticing it. Mm -hmm. These nice little water guns. I'm guessing they are. I have no idea. But his neutral B. What he's mm -hmm. doing is he's constantly trying to catch the bayonetta recoveries, pushing him away so that he can't just snap the ledge, making his recovery life a lot harder. A lot harder. And I mean that's 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 the thing with Smash Brothers. You have to take every every opportunity, every situation in this game is an opportunity. <laughs> To put your care, put your opponent in disadvantage. <laughs> so we're waiting for stage picks once again. So I heard a Lilot ban. Not really surprising. I'm going Yoshi's story instead. Ooh, what do we have here? So I think we have another Pokemon trainer going in. Yeah. I wouldn't is, really see is Jennings about to hit the swap? I wouldn't on on, on tsunami side. I wouldn't see much of a reason to switch because that was a no, he's, he's that was a decisive like, first he's game. Feeling very cozy, you know. It's like the percents were kind of close, yeah. but overall tsunami was. It, it wasn't a blowout, but it was yeah. still a decisive first game. So are we gonna go with it? And we got Grain of Cheddar once again in Jennings. Hands, they're gonna waltz onto the screen dancing together and see if they can catch this dub. Oh, so what, what I'll be interested in now is like they both kind of experience each other's play style a little bit. The question is gonna be how is Jennings gonna adapt with the pick of Yoshi's story? My assumption, because the blast zones are so much closer, including the sky, yes, this is gonna help a lot with his combo game. But again, as we talked about earlier, Squirtle's very hard to combo's Bayo. Nice water gun push to keep her away from the stage. Devil's advocate suggestion though, Yoshi's story is smaller than the stage we just played on last. It, it escapes through the stage we we're just on. But regardless, it's a lot smaller. So I think it was With, Battlefield, but I'm probably I'm, 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 I'm almost certain it was Battlefield, but whizzing, whizzing around like Jennings was in the last game isn't going to be as possible because the stage itself is smaller. She can start aiming for plat Jennings can start aiming for platforms instead, but it's one of those things, oh, we tech those. You have to tech those. You're going to get jabbed. alongside it, too, this mm -hmm. is one of Trainer's better stages because yep. you get kills even earlier. Absolutely. It's, it's a very dangerous game Jennings is playing here. And I mean, yes, it can definitely work in his favor if he works it right, but the smaller stage, I think, is going to give That and give the, the tactical trainer. sit on Squirtle, he knows he's going to die no matter what character yeah. he's on. So sitting on Squirtle to rack up that percent since he got such an early kill is very smart even though he's already at 80%. Oh, absolutely. All this right now is extra credit. I mean, yeah. this man is in class every day and then listens to the professor. Professor says, oh, secret project. You can do it if you want, but you're the one person paying attention, so you'll probably be the only one. Oh, we almost right. had it again. We he's almost about to get that 100% on that project. Zero to 100 real quick. Oh, follows the side B and gets a down smash again for his trouble. So we're seeing a very clear lead from Tsunami now. Ooh, Easy up smash from that Bayonetta. Was, that was wonderful spacing, wonderful spacing. So, now I was probably trying to, I'm gonna start, start I'm gonna use a little bit of fighter lingo here, trying right, to, right. maybe trying to like get some Oki okay off of, you know, getting yeah. up off the ledge and whatnot, but didn't didn't space it right, and actually, uh, and unfortunately, pays for it. But the but the but the the percentage gap right now is enormous. Yeah. And just as I say, it gets an up B as Ivy Sword and takes the kill. Jennings having to play very far so from the I, back. I, I was gonna say this earlier. I mm -hmm. really like the Ivy Sword pick in that situation. Yeah, percent is already kind of high. Oh, she can try and combo you, but I mean, at the end of the day, if she makes one risky move, that's an Bow. easy kill with like up and up B in this case. Oh something my like that. Those Vi Vine Whip is. The deceptive too. Vine Whip is quick and it's strong. It may only hit in like one specific direction but if you are in that direction it's going to hurt. Bow! That's what we call that. Oh. Easy that tilt. Side, oh. Down smash again from the, Squirtle. The, the, the small lip. Hard. The small lip at Yoshi Story assisting in that down smash working so well. So Ooh. already some pretty hype sets so far. That was I think see, the first set, the first, the first game we had with Brave Word and Baron. Brave Word and Baron. Ooh, he's lost signal. Something's happening. With the switches. He said he's gonna do something real quick. Yeah. With the uh, with uh, Brave Word and Baron, that was a hype set, especially with the SDI downward oh. into an upbeat kill at like ten yeah. percent. Maybe not even. It, it was very, very sick. The second set we had, the second game we had was 
this isn't this is this is this is the third game we've had on stream. Yeah. The second game that we had was a lot more calm. This game we just saw was a lot more technical, was a lot more, not technical, but a lot calmer, a lot more collect collected, and there was a lot more, a lot more tangible adaptation, especially on the part of Tsunami, you know? Especially with the last games we saw, instead of just like, he, he'd set things up where he seemed like he'd be standing at the ledge to try and ledge guard, and instead move back and follow the side B and like, get a jab reset down smash and stuff like that. So just clarify this. That was winner's round two. Winner's so round we're gonna two. we're gonna be moving on to winner's round three three here probably. Round three of pools and we are living. Are you in bracket? Nah. So you just I'm here to commentate. That's what we're here for. My boy, ah oh, we on we on sticks. Ah yeah we are. There we are. So we're sitting here. A lot of good sets so far. Mm -hmm. I, I will be excited to see who we see next coming back to our little stream stream home. Like, oh, honestly, one big happy family. That's what we are. One big happy. Ah, one big content. Ah, one, one big existing family. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Sometimes so, sometimes we can sit in the same room and not try to throw knives at each other. And other times we kick around a beach ball really really angry. It just happens, you it know. Just, it just happens. But man. we're all here for each other. We all we all are here to get better at our game. I was actually playing. I was actually playing some Dragon Ball Fighters earlier. Yeah. Like, we, we, no, we're just having a good time. A you know, games. I'm looking around. I'm pretty sure I can see some Marvel, either Marvel or Blaze Blue over there. I'm pretty sure I, it's Blaze no, Blue. That, no, that's cross tag. That is cross. Yeah, that's cross tag. Are y'all playing cross tag in my house? 